What do we need like this very moment with AI when it comes to K-12 and higher education? It's such a complicated time. AI has basically taken a wrecking ball to so many of our traditional assessments. We've got kids hopping on agentic browsers and just saying, hey, go fill out my homework for me. Go write my paper for me. They don't even have to copy and paste, right? Yes, it's been a remarkable tutor and a remarkable coach for students. It's also helped teachers and professors save time and do things that are complicated like differentiation more quickly and effectively. It's also allowed students and professors and teachers to offload tasks that they shouldn't. This thing is coming back to bite professors and teachers around using AI for assessment and feedback. So it's complicated right now. Like what would help? What's the one thing that would be so helpful in this moment? Oh, I know. A whole bunch of new easy buttons for teachers and professors. You just click a button like, hey, write me a report card comment. Write me an IEP. Write next year's course syllabus. Write a letter home to a parent. And who's giving that to us? The good folks at OpenAI. Yeah, we've got ChatGPT for teachers for free, 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 right? The word free is eight times in their press release that came out today. But it's not free. It's free until they're going to charge money for it. We've seen this movie before, right? We've had Magic School. Magic School was free. It had all these buttons. It made AI easy. But in reality, forget the, the bait and switch, which is honestly not great. Like, stop doing that. The more challenging part about this is that the easy button is like a magic wand with one spell. Make me something. But the real value in using AI as a teacher, a professor, anybody, is when this thing is a thought partner, right? Hey, I'm teaching this new unit. I've got, I've got a bunch of new multilingual learners from Ukraine. How do I meet their needs? Or help me pressure test these two approaches to my course. Or here's a bunch of student data. Can you help me kind of identify patterns? Be careful using that non-identifiable or a notebook LM, right? Or even as a coach where you're saying, hey, here's my skill set. Can you help me figure out how to grow my skill set? And the easy button never does that, right? Let's just trust that teachers and professors and school leaders can learn how to explore with AI together in ways that will help them get them the outcomes that they need. Not an easy button. All right, so that's where we are today. We'll see where this goes. Maybe I'm crazy or just frustrated. <laughs> Drop me a note in the comments and let me know what you think, and we'll keep the conversation going.